What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Flicking on My Big Tarot, here where I bring you the beauty, juice, and spiritual truths. I'm your spirit guide host, Miss DC. Y'all already know you do not have to believe in tarot. Do not exclude yourself from the message because this shit can actually happen. Collective. All of my information will be in the description box below. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this video. And if this is so, drop a tip of your girl Cash App, leave a comment, and let me know, okay? Y'all, I'm in this joint cooking, and I felt the need to do a re-in while cooking. So, yeah, making spaghetti. So, if y'all hear that noise back there, that's all it is. I'm not burning down nothing, okay? So, let's see what we got for y'all. Also, I do personals that are pretty accurate. So, if you want to test that out, first one is always free with me, okay? So, we got two cards here. Ooh, I feel like somebody could be dealing with either a narcissist. And I'm not talking about somebody that got narcissistic traits, something like a narcissist. No, full-fledged head-on narcissist. And this person, whoever this person is, they are doing intentional negative shit. Like somebody, somebody got to hear this. Somebody got to see it. And you'll know exactly who I'm talking about. If you're not do if you're not dealing with somebody who's intentionally doing negative shit to you, like purposely fucking with you, then this reading is not for you. But there is somebody here, I'm telling you, and I'm feeling the energy like real strong. Like somebody here is intentionally doing shit to you. Now, the reason I say this is because my ex-narcissist, and he was a full-fledged, narcissist ex-military he probably watching this shit right now it's so but just saying and for christmas one year he came to my door at like two something in the morning with a bag full of stuff and all of this is the items that was in there papers matter of fact the papers had pretty much him telling on himself everything that he had did bad to me, okay? Then the rear view or the side mirror to my car, he knocked that shit off. And then this one wasn't even mine. He bought that randomly from somewhere, probably stole it off somebody else's car, okay? A card, some lingerie that was for a fat girl, a pack of Oreo, um, not Oreos, Pringles, a dollar and a honey bun. And I don't, let me just bring my computer up. Just a little bit, okay? Y'all see that dollar right there? This was a little honey bun out, out a pack of eight, a thing of Pringles. And this was like a crayon, Crayola little set that he got for my daughter. Okay, crazy, right? Yeah, he was mentally, physically, spiritually, all type of leads, okay, just bad, abusive. And he intentionally did it because he was a narcissist. I literally had to, um, there's a guy that I reached out to who's really, really good. If you all ever need help or need advice or information, Quinn Holiday, Associates Direct on YouTube. I was able to meet him. I might go ahead and even put that in the comments. He is a narcissistic life coach and he deals specifically with these type of people, okay? So somebody is dealing with this, this type of individual or this person. And this is from the flicking on my big meme. This is my Oracle card deck that I created. I'm actually getting ready to re remake this, redo this set with all of the memes that I've made and I've made a lot of them. And I'm gonna turn it into a um, I'm gonna turn it into a bigger oracle card deck. This deck I'm getting ready to use here is the flicking on my big number what oracle card deck involving numbers. Business is happening around you at this time. So if I feel like you might either you might work with this person, you may work with this person. If you don't, and you might be trying to figure out what the fuck is wrong with them. Like something is off or like your intuition might be right. Something might be completely off 
with this person. Okay, if this is somebody that you're dealing with at work, do not get involved with them. If you have to work with them, you better separate yourself. Okay, I've dealt with two male narcissists in my life, relationship wise. I even have a video on my YouTube channel talking about it. It's a little explicit, not the worst you've ever heard, but it was it was an experience. Okay. So y'all can check that out. I'm going to even put that, um, I'm going to try to put that link up here somewhere so that y'all can see it. But y'all, the shit is real. Do not fuck with them. Do not. This person, I feel like to some degree may work with you. They may be trying to get some money with you from you because if you get the money, trust and believe they're going to take it. So I wouldn't even try business. Look, trust your intuition. Trust in the benevolence of the universe. If the, the if the universe is telling you, I like them, but something is off, trust that shit. You're dealing with somebody. You're dealing with a narcissist and they're intentionally doing that shit. Whatever it is, I don't even know what they doing. They do so much shit, un, so much underhand. Listen, they do so much underhanded shit. Some of that shit you won't even know. Listen. If you know what's best for you, leave them alone. Trust your intuition. If you have to work with them or you have to deal with them, don't, don't try to hold no conversation. Don't try to make no sense. Don't try to argue. It's not going to work. Have you ever just went back and forth with somebody and it's like, they're just not hearing you? It's like, dog, why do you keep doing that? What am I doing? Dog, this is what you're doing. You always do this. What am I doing? I'm not doing it. Like, they're going to start to make you think you crazy. It's going to be irritating as fuck. I'm telling you, leave these people alone. Somebody is dealing with a narcissist. Let's go ahead and get into this tarot. Bottom of the deck, balance. Somebody needs a sense of balance right now. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. And like I said, I feel like something, something is off about this person and I can feel it. Something is off about this person and it's like i feel like this might be a situation where they're pouring into your cup right now so you may right now be feeling like well this person is really giving to me or this person really cares like you're in that emotion you're not in the emotion of oh they don't fuck with me that's why they keep doing this why they don't like me why they not you know fucking with me why they not doing this why they not hold on a second y'all hold on hold on yeah so it's like Whoever this person is, I just feel like if you're if you're not in a negative energy with them, it could be that phase of what do they call it? Um, love bomb, where they're giving you this attention, they're agreeing with you, they kiki, ha ha ha, all of this shit, trying to invite you places, take you out, buy you drinks, whatever. But it's really the bare minimum what they're doing. It don't seem like it because it's so subtle. I'm telling y'all. I've dealt with narcissists. I even dealt with a narcissist girl. Not, not, not like that. I worked with one and I saw the damage her ass did. I really did. And it was crazy because I used to let her do my daughter hair, but this is before I knew she was crazy. Okay. So yes, yeah, somebody wants to move forward and they want to do it quickly. Somebody is pouring into you and it seems very quick. I'm telling you, somebody, this person, I feel like somebody might be uh, putting into your car. So if somebody is helping you pay for your car or putting money towards your car, or this is somebody who you probably, they ain't ne somebody that ain't never helped you with your car. Oh, they giving me gas money. Oh, they cleaning my car windows. Oh, they pumping the gas for me. They don't put tents on my shit. You know what I'm saying? Whoever this is, they might be putting a little bit into your car. They may be saying, babe, let me drive it. Be afraid. Be very afraid because this will be the type of person to get in your motherfucking car, be going too fast, and do some reckless shit. Listen, you might even, I, 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 you might, somebody is afraid of this. It's like, damn, you you doing a whole lot too early or a whole lot too soon. I feel like somebody knows Either you know or they know. Somebody knows. Somebody is afraid to move forward with somebody else or they're going to act like they're afraid, but they're not really afraid. 
they're going to act like they're afraid. Oh, you know what? I like you or whatever, but I mean, I don't really know. Like we moving too fast. And then you're going to be like, no, nah, I thought we was cool. I thought, no, nah, they know what the fuck they doing. They know what they doing. Asses. They know what they doing. Somebody like, I'm listen, 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 Linda's. Okay. And Lenard's. Listen, Linda and Lenard. I'm telling you. Okay. Whoever this person is, they're pouring into you. They're doing it quickly, but somebody, but there's going to be a, a, you see how, let me show you this. You see how you got the stability. You got the calm, the, this is somebody who they're, they're balanced out. Like everything is going good. Everything is fine. It's not too hot. It's not too cold. It's not too, you know what I'm saying? It's just, everything is just balanced. Everything is going well but it's going quickly. It's like, okay. It's like when you cut on the sink and you cut it on a little bit and it's drip, 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 until it just starts to pour. Okay. So that's kind of what is going on. I feel like somebody right now is just in this energy of, it's like, I'm going to pour into you and I'm going to give you the, the, the interpretation. I'm going to give you the visual that shit, everything's sweet, but narcissists can't stay consistent for too long they wear that mask for halloween and then the day after halloween they pull it off and you like whoa what the fuck is that y'all know what i'm talking about shout out quinn holiday because i'm with the way he be describing shit that these motherfuckers do i'm telling y'all i'm telling you i should have been a therapist because i'm telling y'all i got i just have my way of talking to people that that can understand like shit is for real, real. And a lot of y'all don't listen. Y'all don't listen. Y'all got to test the waters until the shit too late. But I'm trying to tell you, I've helped several people. Okay. I'm giving you a full warning, but this is my thing. If you decide to indulge after you've been warned and your intuition is telling you, whatever happens, you deserve it. You deserve it. I know it's a little harsh, but... I did it and I deserved it because I didn't listen. I knew it was wrong and I still consciously decided to deal with bullshit. And I deserved it until dot, dot, dot. I didn't deserve it no more. And then my ex in New Jersey, his motherfucking ass, I met another one, uprooted my whole life and moved with this fool. And then in the night, that nigga snapped. He did. I should go ahead and do a part two of me dealing with a narcissist part two and tell my story because these motherfuckers are crazy. Y'all, I got a lot of energy, but I ain't fucking nuts. Like these people are crazy. Whoever you dealing with, I'm picking up the energy. Yes, they're trying to slowly but surely build with you or give you the impression that they're trying I don't know if y'all can see that or not. They're trying to give the impression that they're slowly but surely trying to build with you. So they're going to pour into you and you won't be thinking, yeah, this girl don't know what she's talking about. Tuh. Thank God don't. Look, look, look. It fell off the deck. Doing something. Didn't I say they were moving very quickly? Doing something impulsive? Okay, this is what that card is. The Knight of Swords in reverse. This is somebody who's doing something impulsive. It's doing something without thinking. It's acting, reacting before acting, whatever it is. It's, this is what this person is doing. They're moving really fast, acting impulsive. So this is somebody, this is somebody who, let me try to give you an example. It's like this person to say, oh, I'm gonna take you out to dinner tonight. And then- uh, let's say, let's say you met Monday, Wednesday. Let's, let me, let me take you out to dinner. Then they take you out to dinner. We can go in your car. I'll put gas in it. I'll even drive if you want. You know what I'm saying? I'll drive there so you can just sit and look pretty or you can sit and look good or whatever. Mind you, you just met them Monday and Wednesday. They already talking about trying to drive your car, putting gas in it. Y'all go and eat. They done paid for it. That weekend, they taking you out of town somewhere. You ain't never been. 
splurging, putting all of this money into you. And you like, damn, they really like me. Shit, my stuff must really be that good. Y'all ain't even did a check. Y'all ain't even did a check. You know what I'm saying? This is that person. It's like they're impulsively doing stuff. They're spending money on you that they know they don't have. They're doing all of this to kind of get you wrapped up in them. So then once you're fully invested in them, dun, 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 the bullshit is going to come out. I promise y'all, don't play with narcissistic people. And somebody is dealing with one. A lot of y'all probably dealing with one. I'm telling you, don't, don't do it. They will fuck up your life, your money, your family, your mind. All of that shit. They will do it. Yeah. All the while manipulating you and you over here, they over here manipulating the shit out you, trying to build with you and you don't understand why, damn, why my hair hurt. Damn, I like this person, but I can't even, like, my, my, my shit, a mess. Like, it's like, damn, I can't even, it's like, it's so much going on, you can't even wrap your mind around what is really going on. They sitting here putting a little spell on you, probably get you down. And she probably, you know what I'm saying? To the point where you, you starting to get nervous. I'm telling y'all, this is, the, and this is what they topsy turvy. They be having you, do, 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 do. you don't know what the fuck to do with yourself. It's like, damn, am I coming? Am I going? Am I stopping? Am I go? Like, I'm telling y'all, trust your intuition. And whoever this person is, may be at your job, may work with you. Let's go ahead and hold on, y'all. This should be a mukbang. Ahead and cut that off so yeah let's go ahead and clarify bottom of the deck see see somebody is trying to pour into you they're trying to give you excitement that you've never had and whoever this person is they talk to you for a little bit before they really got too involved because they had to fill you out they had to know what you like and whoever this person is they're very energetic at first okay somebody here is very, very energetic. And they're pouring into you slowly but surely. They're giving you the time of your life. They're giving you the time of your life. But full of secrets. You, you only see what's on the surface. You don't see what's below the surface. You don't see why they pouring into you so quick. And, and the impulsiveness is there. You don't see all of that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all really got to look at these people. And and, and 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 if you feel something is off, it's like, damn, I like them. But it's, I don't know. It's just something. Something. Your intuition is like, it starts here. Like, Whoever this person is, they got secrets and lots of them. I can guarantee you that this person is living a double life above land, underneath it, around it. It don't even matter. I'm telling y'all, whoever this person is, they're, they're moving forward quickly towards you, but they're being very impulsive. They're being very impulsive. You see two horses. This person got horsepower. I'm trying to tell you, y'all be wanting to listen, but y'all heard it here. If you watching this and this pertains to you, you know if it pertains to you. And I know a lot of y'all gonna still deal with that person and, and it's not fine, but you know what? What I'm gonna say is because I know how it is. Y'all like them, y'all mm -hmm. invested, the sex is good. See, they don't want me to get this message out. My computer is, is uh acting up now. They don't want me to get the message out. Too bad. I'm going to get that shit out. Pull this last one so you can't. Yeah. And what you and what you think they're going to do? They're going to drop you. 
They're going to waste your time, waste your money, waste your energy, waste your resources. See, they putting on that, they putting on that facade right now. And once they drop you, you're going to be in this energy. You're going to be like, what the fuck happened? They're going to they gonna manipulate this shit out you. I'm telling you, they're going to manipulate this shit out you. Have you thinking you done found the one ready to get married and drop you like a hot earth potato. And potatoes be hot as hell when they sit in boiling water for a long time. But what ain't? I'm telling y'all, they're going to manipulate you into you in this fear. They're going to manipulate you into you scared. They're going to put you in this depression have you having anxiety trying to figure out you're going to be what the fuck is wrong? Have you feeling crackheadish? I'm telling y'all, whoever this person is will get you in that mode, get you in that. Ugh, what's wrong? And you don't even know it's them. Your whole world be they the type of motherfuckers that will literally hide your keys and make you and, 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 and watch you. Be scattering, looking for them. Make you feel like you crazy. <laughs> I got their keys and they don't even know. In my motherfucking pants. In my purse. Somewhere I know he ain't never gonna look. Them keys sitting right in my purse. Go ahead and look for them. Babe, what you looking for? You lost your keys? Oh my God. Let's, so that means we can't go? They ain't even worried about your keys. They ain't even worried about your keys. Talking about some, oh, we still can't go? They know y'all can't go nowhere. Like, they do stuff like that. I'm telling y'all, they do stuff like that. Leave them alone. If you don't, you better. Oh, let's taste test real quick. Oh, oh, look what they done made me. No. Narcissist, I'm just playing. Narcissist to make you do that. I done had a few, but guess what, bitch? I got a backup. And I run my own water. And I'm going to clean up my own mess. Hold up, y'all. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Let me skip over that. <laughs> mm. I don't know if y'all can see it. Mm. And it's hot. Y'all see that grease on the spoon? After you done cooked the sauce? Mmm. I know I gotta add that lip smack in here. Mm. If you don't, you better. 